Hi to everyone. Today we are going to uh, knowing about uh, how to install STS editor in your PC. Guys, many of the students asking me, sir, uh, we are confusing uh, to downloading and install the STS tool to developing Spring Boot applications. That's why. So I am going to uh, explaining you guys from scratch and the how to download and the how to install STS tool for our Spring Boot application developers. So guys, observe here, I here, here I given five steps. The first step is what a visit uh, spring.io.tools website. This is the official website to download our STS tool. And you know guys, how Eclipse ID is uh, using to editing our Java code. In the same way, we are going to using okay, STS tool. But in industry, many of the developers, okay, many, many, many of the developers uh, to edit their uh, Spring Boot application, they are going to using Spring Boot application, what STS tool only, STS tool only. So please understand, this is very, very important editor to editing our Java code. And uh, look at the first one is what? To visit uh, spring.io.tools website. Uh, if you go with any browser, no problem. And uh, next, uh, here you can select uh, Spring Tools for, for Eclipse. Means uh, for Eclipse means what? This ID also looks like Eclipse ID only. Okay, next one is, and uh, here it can display the many versions, many, so many STS uh, software types, means uh, STS for Windows, STS for uh, Mac OS, STS for Linux, like this, many will be displayed. But we guys are using uh, Windows application, Windows operating system. That's why we are going to downloading STS for Windows. So, and uh, one more important point, guys, and that while you are downloading, uh, this this STS tool no need to pay the single NP also because of this it is an open source open source very very important and then and step the STS tool software and uh, just one one button will be appear there then I will show you now and uh, click on it and that uh, one zip will be downloaded in your PC and after downloading it that zip file simply you can extract that STL tool tool. And uh, in that in that uh, one one folder, uh, one icon will be displayed. That is what STS icon. Simply make the shortcut on your desktop and double click on it. Automatically, okay, our ID will be okay available in your PC. So same thing I am going to showing you now. Please understand. Simply go to the any browser and here I am going to typing the simple simple word STS download. STS download. Simply click on it. And uh, and it is it is directly navigating to our official website is called spring.io. Guys, already we saw this website. Okay, simply click on Spring Tools on this 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 link, and automatically it will show the our official website. Simply come to down, come to down. Please don't go with Spring Tools for 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 Visual Studio Code. And it, this is also we are going to using that is not uh, okay. We'll see later that one. And but you can focus on this one. Spring Tools for for Eclipse ID, guys. Just now I, I told you STS for Linux, STS for Mac OS like that. But uh, we are using here Windows Windows operating system. That's why STS for what uh, Windows XE. Simply click on it, and here your downloading will be started. Okay, here started one. Okay, now the file size is is nothing but a five thirty four MB. Guys, already I downloaded, so you must be wait, okay? And just I'm going to do pass here. And uh, after click on it, and our zip file will be downloaded. And uh, this downloading file uh, in my PC available in our downloading. And you know, guys, even you can download automatically that one available in our downloading folder only. Now, simply I'm going to downloading folder. And uh, here is the file. Here is the file, STL. This is the folder. This is the folder. So what I am doing, what I am doing, simply copy this folder. Please understand. You can go with any drive, any drive. So simply now I am going with a, a E drive or D drive or C drive. You, you can your wish. I am not going to force you to use a specific drive, guys. Just I am going to going with D drive here. So in D drive, okay, to to save this folder. Now I am going to creating the simple one folder. Right click on it. And go to the new. Here you can create one folder. The folder name is what? STS software like that. You can use any name, but uh, specifically I am going to using STS software. Simply double click on it. 
and here you can paste what you copied just now. Okay, now uh, our uh, Spring Boot uh, STS tool GIF folder is uh, copied here. Guys, uh, here you can do two things. This is very, very important. This is a GIF folder actually. Okay, select it and right click on it. And uh, here we have a option extract here. So now our STS tool are going to extracting. So this, these steps are very, very important. It will take some time. Please, you must, you must be wait. Okay, now almost is then. Okay, now, now. And look at here, guys. After extracting, this is our original folder actually. And uh, once you extracted here and one more folder is came, that is what contents. Am I right? And again, you can do extract this, this folder. So what I will do, right click on it. This is a very, very important file. And uh, do extract here. So it will take time. So patience is must. So now it is going to extracting. Wait a moment. Okay, almost done. 80-80 percentage. 88 percentage. Ninety percentage. 10 percentage more. Many of the student asking me, sir, uh, how to download and how to install STS in your PC, uh, especially for a uh, Spring Boot developer. So that's why I created this small video, guys, for beginners and uh, experienced people also. Please understand. Now, uh, after complete this one, uh, look at here uh, after this, and it will extract it one more folder. Very, very important. This one. Very, very important. This one. This is what STS uh, 4.18. This one. Okay. And this folder. Just simply, you can double click on it on this folder. And uh, here we have a option. Okay, the one, one image is uh, appear here. A Spring Tool Suit Four. Okay, simply what I will do: select, right click on it, select, right click on it. Okay, and uh, here we have a option Send to. Okay, here we have a option Create a Desktop Shortcut. Just click on it. That's it. Your installation is completed. But don't remove this folder. Okay, now close it. Automatically, you have a shortcut here. Simply double click on it, guys. Now, your Eclipse means STS ID is coming. Okay. And this ID also looks like Eclipse ID only. So, this ID, okay, this ID using for Spring Boot developer to developing Spring Boot web application and to developing Spring Boot REST API applications. And after this, we'll see, okay, how to create Spring Boot uh, application means uh, Spring Boot uh, uh, application by using STL tool. Uh, after this next uh, next video, we'll see. But initially, you can understand then how to uh, download and how to install STL tool in our in our in our PC. So what happened now? It is loading. So after getting this one, just double click on it, and now our STS tool is down uh, loading, guys. It will take some time. So look at this is looks like a same thing. Already, I have actually this tool. And if you, if you are new, what happened? Uh, I'm closing everything here. Don't worry about this one. And uh, it looks like like this, guys. And it is also looking like uh, our uh, means uh, 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 Eclipse ID only. Look at here, file, edit, source, reference, like this it can be appear on your PC. And uh, here you can start create, creating your Spring Boot application and uh, you can run it, it will be work. In next video, we'll see how to create Spring Boot application by using STS tool. Okay. Thank you, guys.
please subscribe to my channel okay have a nice day